Hello everyone, this is Ashwin from TechBlue Solutions once again and in this video I am going to show you about the Gmail Labs and also the keyboard shortcuts used in Gmail. For that you need to log in into your Gmail and in the right upper corner of your page you can see a gear button, click on that and go to the settings and then a page will be opened and then in that you will click on the lab section and then in this you will see a lot of labs that are enabled in your Gmail and as well as available now. So if I consider this lab, this particular thing, this is unread message icon. It is being developed by Manu C. So it tells you how many messages are unread in your mailbox. So it is currently enabled. That means you can see here there is no, I mean, no, num no number of mails to be read. That is all the, read, all the mails are read by me. So it is zero here. If you have any hundred means, then the number will be incremented. So if I click here, disable, then and click on the save changes. So it will be automatically reloaded, and you can see here there is no number marking here. That means the app is disabled. Similarly, if you want to re-enable it, go to the settings again. Well, it's taking some time. Yes, it's open. Now again go to the labs and you can see here we'll find the app in the available app section. Write down here, yes. So you can see here this is disabled currently. So again you want to enable it, you can do it and again save changes. Yes, saved and again the page will be reloaded and then you are done. So this is the process of enabling and disabling labs in your Gmail and let's go to the keyboard shortcuts for this now go to the inbox and go to the settings again and you can see here if you scroll down the uh, general page you can see an option that keyboard shortcuts off and keyboard shortcuts on you can click on on if you want it to be enabled so you can go down and click on save changes so it is changed now so if you want to use keyboard shortcuts then it's up to you now so basically if you don't know anything about the keyboard shortcuts then you should press shift plus question mark then you can see a pop-up with all the available keyboard shortcuts for your gmail page so if you want to open a new window you can open it or you can close it so commonly used uh, keyboard shortcuts I will explain you first of all for example if you press on C then you can go to the compose a main new mail button new mail a page so if you want to reply for a particular mail then I mean open it and if you click on R then it will be creating a, a column where you can give a reply for that and some of the other shortcuts is for example if you want to go to the start messages mails directly so you can press first of all G and then S you can yes I think there are no start messages in my account now so you can see directly and in a similar way there are several shortcuts for your Gmail so in this way you can enable keyboard shortcuts and you can disable by going again to the page settings and scrolling down here and keyboard shortcuts off so save changes yes and there you go so in this way you can do the keyboard shortcuts so that's it for the video thanks for watching and please be free to subscribe for my videos and to give me feedback about the videos thank you